As I started filming this, I had a full cup of coffee. I did two or three takes, so I drank it earlier. It was too good to resist, and I'm sorry about that, but the prop still stands. Okay, I'm David. This is Derby's Wellbeing and Fitness Channel, where we give you the latest studies on uh, health and fitness so that you can make better decisions regarding your health and your fitness. When it comes to coffee, we have all always known that it's good for us because of the way we feel. And certainly there have been countless studies which show that if we do drink coffee, it helps protect our heart from a lot of inflammatory effects, inflammatory effects, sorry, and also it helps us uh, be mentally sharper and feel physically stronger. Anecdotally, we have known that if we drink coffee before workout, we feel stronger. But we have never really been able to quantify this. And plugging this exact gap, there's a study which came out in December 2023, which I'm going to link to in the description box on YouTube, so please check it out, which says that essentially, if we ingest a cup of coffee 30 to 40 minutes before a workout, our endurance level can go up to about 31%, which is quite a significant rise, and our intensity levels in trained subjects can go anywhere between 2 and 16%. Furthermore, studies have also shown that if we drink three or four cups of coffee throughout the day, our expenditure in terms of energy can increase by up to about 100 kilocalories per day. So our metabolic rate increases, which is good news if you're trying to lose weight, maybe, but certainly it's good news if you want to be active throughout the day and you don't want to slow down. So if you're going to start your workout, before you work out, the question is coffee or no coffee? The answer should most definitely be coffee every time. Thank you for watching this. We're going to have a lot more stuff coming out throughout the year. Take care and look after yourselves. Bye.